What's up guys? Death Row here. Um, today I have an unboxing video for you. Um, this is the Blue Driver. It's produced by Lemur. And basically what this is, is a Bluetooth device that hooks up to your data link connector on any 96 and newer vehicle. So all makes, import, domestic, European, doesn't matter. Uh, it is. It uses an app to run it. Um, it does use Apple or Android. Um, it has this nifty little little scan image here that you can. It'll take you right to the app itself. Um, and there you go. Apple iPod, Android, iPad. It's a model number. It up. Toss that aside. Uh, you get a little card. They have 24 hour support, seven days a week. You can download the owner's manual and uh, all that kind of stuff. Throw that aside too. So, in the box, the only thing in the box is this little nifty little thing here. Now this would be called a dongle, and basically this hooks up to your OBD2, OBD2 port, sorry, and again, you can scan it with your phone or Apple, uh, your, any device you have, iPad, Android, whatever, and uh, it'll take you, you can get the app, or you can visit them on bluedriver.net and download it from there. Okay, so for the purpose of this video, I am going to be using my 2015 RAM, the 5.7. Just to show you, there is a data link connector. Uh, generally on most vehicles, there are somewhere under the dash close to either the front kick panel or in this case, right by the hood release. So we hook this up. It only goes one way. You can't screw it up. The blue light comes on to show you that it's powered. And then I'll show you how the rest works from there. Okay, so once you get it all hooked up, and as you can see, we are connected, um, we can go ahead and scan our vehicle. Now, guess what? I have an engine light on. For the purpose of this video, I've actually made, an, made a fault. So we can go ahead and we can read the codes. Now it gives you a couple of different options. You can read the trouble codes, um, just the check engine light, the common dash lights, and all system modules. Uh, for this purpose, we're just gonna go ahead and check the engine light. And it's gonna do a quick scan. And sure enough, we have a PO113 intake air temperature sensor circuit high bank one now again as i said i have made my engine light come on myself so we have possible causes so what we can do this is going to scan and retrieve any kind of common issues that may be related to that code so around outside plugged in my temperature sensor and now we're gonna scan again. So, get the code. We're gonna clear the code. Scan again. Voila, code's gone. Let's go back. Um, of course, this works in landscape mode too. So a couple other features here, again, vehicle info. So it does show that it is a 2015 Chrysler. It doesn't tell you that it's a Ram or anything until you go into specifications. And there you go, 1500, it's a Tradesman Edition, two door, made in Mexico. Tells you pretty much everything about the build of this vehicle. Again, you can share it. 
use it for your own purposes. Uh, this one, um, it does show recalls. So you got some recalls. Maintenance schedule shows you all the maintenance for your vehicle. And this, again, this is VIN specific, so it's it's specific to your make and model. Recalls, we already did that. Service bulletins. Those are always fun. Um, there's also freeze frame for your engine light. Mode 6. Repair reports. Mill status, which basically tells you whether or not the, uh, the engine light is on. And then of course we have live data. Let's start up the car. Real time. So you can see the commanded throttle actuator. You can just click on it as well. It shows you shows you this nifty little little gauge. And basically you can go you can go through there's a whole bunch of stuff there that you can go through. You can add stuff to it. You can make it all to whatever however you want to look at it again. Landscape mode. Nice and colorful, easy to read. Uh, from here you can also update the sensor, update the firmware. Check for updates. Everything seems to be update up to date. And you get your owner's manual, settings. Uh, you can order a sensor through the app as well if you just want to download the app and order the sensor straight from the app. So there you have it, the Blue Driver by Lemur. It has a lot more features and functions than I've discussed in the video just for time's sake. Um, I've been using it for a couple of months now and it works great. Uh, I am a professional mechanic, I work in the field, I work at a dealership. I use it almost on a daily basis and it's replaced my snap-on scan tool that was about $4,200 for about a hundred bucks. Um, admit, again, it, it doesn't do everything that my snap-on scan tool did, but this pretty much does a lot. And uh, that says a lot coming from a mechanic that works in the field that this is a great product, trust me. Um, you'll love it. I will leave a, um, a link to the a link in the description as to where I got it and how much it cost. And enjoy your product, guys. Thanks for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe uh, if you want more videos like this. This is my first unboxing video. Hopefully, it went well. Thanks for watching, guys. Awesome. Have a great day.